Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can uh, create a design in Canva and then optimize that design into a high resolution design so that you can use it uh, for your printing services or if you want to maybe um, uh, create an ebook cover and, uh, and then uh, sell on Amazon KDP. Uh, so that's what you're going to learn today by the end of this video. If you are new here, my name is Steve from stevenjohnsy.com. I create two videos a week, one video for personal development and the other video is usually about health and nutrition. And uh, I hope that uh, you will learn something from this uh, video. Uh, before we continue, guys, I'll ask you to subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every time I post a new video. Alrighty, let's get into it. As you can see, I'm now on uh, canva.com homepage. Uh, as you can see, uh, I've got all these templates here. If you don't have Canva account, uh, please just sign up. It's free. You can sign up for free and then uh, I get access to all these uh, templates and designs that you can play around with and find something that you love. Uh, otherwise, I'll leave a link down below if you want to try Canva for Pro which has got more than uh, what you will have here with a free account, but you will have access for 30 days for free just to play around with it and then see whether you like it or not. Uh, I'm sure it will help you indeed. So the plan is to create the design with Canva and then optimize that design into a high resolution design so that you can use it uh, either for your as an ebook cover and print it out or use it as a design that you want to print uh, like in your mug or in your books, in your t-shirts with a print on demand services that we have uh, so that's what we're going to do and usually they want a very high resolution uh, design or image uh, up to like uh, um, 300 dpi so that's what i'll show you uh, uh, today and uh, if you want to know more about canva i'll link up the video here uh, that i did in the past about canva for beginners so you'll learn quite a lot from that uh, video as well Alrighty, so i did uh, have a design that i just made before and uh, this is the design here i just picked up anything so you just pick up the design from this side into the canvas and then you play around with it. we add a few things as you can see added that so let's uh, assume we finished our design this is the design that we want then we want to download it so that we can go and print it with the high resolution so what we need to do obviously is to come here uh, to download and then uh, usually um, Canva will, uh, when you just do it uh, the first time, it will uh, suggest like a PNG for you. But for this video, I'm going to show you a different way. So we're not going to go with what Canva is suggesting. We will go with um, PDF print. I know you must be wondering, oh, why, Steve, are you uh, printing as a PDF? We want an image that we can use. So that, that's fine. We'll get to that. <laughs> so just select PDF print and then download. So as you can see, it will download um i'll get to that so let's check that um pdf um it's down here let's bring it up and see <coughs> excuse me uh it should come up uh, in a sec as you can see it's coming up i'll just uh, bring it up there as you can see this is the um pdf that we've got so we want this pdf to turn into a png with a high resolution uh, um, uh, at the end so let's uh, do that now to do that we're going to go to a website called www.onlineconverter.com so it's online-converter.com so i uh, will get you to that website and then you will see the magic happens from there go to google and then type um, uh, onlineconverter.com so there it comes because I've, I've been using it uh, so usually it's at the top uh, like number one number two you'll find it up there so it is this one We'll click on to that and then we will get to the home page of uh, online converter and this is the home page which has got so many different things that you can do with this website and amazingly it's free uh, and especially what we're doing today it's free you can sign up so you can get more if you want but for this tutorial we're going to have a free uh, version of it and then uh, what we want is to convert our pdf into a um, jpeg or into a, a png so you can either come here a pdf to jpeg or you can come here and then put what you want to do. So we want to convert um, a PDF to uh, PNG. So we just click on that. PNG is there. And then it will, it will start running straight away. And then it brings out this page. And uh, then uh, what we do next is to get that image that we've just created, the PDF image. You're going to put it into here. So I'll go to my uh, files there. And then this is the PDF that we've just created there. And then I will drag it into here and then it will start uh, downloading. Uh, once it's uh, done 100%, it will tell us that it's done. Then we can start the conversion. 
as you can see it's almost done there you go it's 100 percent and then done so it's uh, already now so what we need to do now is to come down here to the optional settings and then we are going to come to dpi and then uh, enter 300 there because that's uh, what we want to uh, our image to be at uh, the dpi we want so after that that's all you need to do we can do other things for now we just want to optimize it to 300 dpi uh, after doing that just um, start conversion and then it will tell you straight away once it's done um, then we will download the PNG folder. That's it, uh, it's all completed as you can see. And then I'm going to download it. Um, then I'll show you, as you can see there, it's downloading, it's done. I'll bring it up, as you can see, this is our new, um, um, <clears throat> this is our new uh, image, um, as you can see. So what you need to do to see the whether it is done what you want it's got the three um the 300 uh, dpi so you go to tools and then inspector show inspector and then you look at the information there from the photo so as you can see it's a png now and uh, it's done now and then these are the pixels and then this is what we wanted to do so as you can see the dpi is 300 how good is that so we already now you can now go to a website like a printful or whatever that you use for your print on demand and print your shirts your t-shirts your designs and you know all that or you can even go to amazon kdp and put this onto your cover design and create an ebook that you can sell uh, uh, on amazon or even do um, a paperback on amazon because you'll have a proper resolution uh, image Alrighty guys, I hope you've enjoyed this guys. If you have, if you've learned something, uh, leave comments below and let me know what you think and what else you want me to um, to do for the next video. Uh, and uh, ask you again guys, just subscribe to this uh, channel, hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every time I post a new video. Your likes and comments will really, really help uh, grow the channel. This is the channel for you guys to learn something new every week. With that guys, I thank you and I wish you a great day. Take care. Bye.